So this is Moberg of Sweden on the inside. In lane two, Chick, Lucas Chick. Alongside him, Ricard, Richard Nagy, Paul, Jakob, Simanski. And then Sasha Zoya, just remember he can vault 556 as well. Stefan Schubert. And then Abel Alejandro Jordan. The outside lane. Samuel Maffazoni. Well, if this goes to form, it may well be just a race for second behind Sasha Zoya. But as we've already seen, it's not too difficult in the hurdles to come to grief. Mark Hyden from the last semi-final will be a testament, a testament to that. So from the inside, Moberg, Sweden, Chick of Croatia, Nagy, Hungary, Szymanski, Poland, Zoya, France, Schubert, Czech Republic, Hoda, Spain, and Maffezoni of Italy. Zoya out very quickly. Zoya the first to rise over the first three hurdles, also doing well at this stage. Szymanski of Poland, and it looks like Szymanski, despite clattering some of the hurdles, taking a clear second spot, but no doubt at all the winner. Just look at that time. Well, it's wind assisted at 2.4, but it's a sub 13 second clocking. Well, Sasha Zoya. What a terrific run from Zoya. He's never run as fast as that under any circumstances. And it's just a slight wind assistance that invalidates it as a championship record. Yes, would otherwise be also a European junior record. Willem Belossi on 12.99, but maybe that's to come in the final. We've seen that wind has been just over that uh, two metres per second for around half an hour now. Well, that really was a dominating run. It's difficult to see anybody beating Sasha Zoya. I just wonder what he's capable of in the final. And let's just keep our fingers crossed that the breeze just dies down just a little bit. So, just to mark your cards. 17.57 is the final of the men's 110 metres hurdles tomorrow afternoon. So that's 16.57 Central European time. 